My name is Quincy, and this is my wife, Megan. We're high school sweethearts who are choosing to escape the ordinary and travel the world. We decided to sell everything and leave our home behind for the adventure of a lifetime. Subscribe to our channel and see where we're off to next. Not perfect, but it looks pretty calm. We'll give it a try, we'll see how it is. Wind's starting to pick up. So we just left our normal beach at Charlie's because it was like completely cloudy and looked like it was gonna rain. And then we were just driving around. We were gonna go to Black Rock, but we were driving, I don't know exactly where we are right now, on the way to Black Rock, across from the dive center on the way to Black Rock. Yeah, it's really nice. This, we haven't actually come to this beach, but we've driven by it and it was super wavy. But right now, I think everyone on the island is here because it's just like a pool with no wind, the sun. It's like, where in the world do you see like the water this color? Oh my God. So clear, and it just got like 10 degrees warmer. My favorite place to be is right here Not thinking about what brings me down Good morning, Megan. Good morning. Can you hold my key? Sure. What's happening? Oh, uh, we're at this beach and when the sun comes out, the water glows. So glorious. And the coral is also glorious here, if you were wondering. Do you know what beach we're at? Um, I don't know. Past the Murray section. Yeah. I actually prefer this area because the Murray Beach has tons of those boats 
like tourist boats in it. This is just like blue. There's no one really here. And there's a public washroom. We didn't know when we came in, we were like, is this someone's property? But as you can see, like you can just park pretty much anywhere here. Park on any of these grassy areas. Just don't park underneath a coconut tree. Yeah, and also be careful walking under them because they always are falling. Like the flowers grow fast, like no thanks, no I'm doing just fine, one foot in another. Floating, enjoying my freedom, singing off key. I like it better when I'm under the sun. Ooh. So we just pulled over at the beach across from Chantel's Concierge. Whoa, and the waves are huge. Yeah, there's some big waves out there today. It's pretty crazy, but the lagoon goes around the entire island and you can't really tell today because it's a little choppy in the lagoon, but it's absolutely beautiful. Look at that water. Glorious. I'm not gonna go scuba diving today because of the wind and you can see how big the waves are on the reef out there. It's nice right here. This is a good little spot. Give me all you got Dancing to the beat Love is all we need I don't know where to stay I don't know where to go I'm going round in circles And the days are moving slow I don't know what to fake I don't know what to show But I really, really love you I will never let you go Just keep on breathing It's a funny feeling You're the one that makes it all alright Give me all you got So we just pulled over at Black Rock Beach and we're gonna do some swimming here. There's no one here for one. Normally this place is like super packed with people. Crab. Cool. It's really warm on this side of the island. Pretty much always. Every once in a while it gets a little bit rough, but Just a tip, if you want to come to Black Rock, definitely come at low tide. Seems to be the most beautiful at low tide. We're just cruising the island today looking for a good snorkel beach. This side of the island's a little bit windy, but look. What? There's something washed up on the beach there. Like what? A half a boat. Oh wow. We're gonna do some snorkeling here. It looks amazing. Why is it coming in, like following us right now though? Well, let's go quick. Just another day snorkeling in Rorotonga. The water is very clear today. <laughs> strong current today though. You can pull it that way. The waves behind me are so big it sounds like thunder sometimes. So we just attempted snorkeling here and 
and the current is way too strong. We, it was fine for like one minute and then we just started drifting down the beach so, so fast. quickly. And you can't actually tell by looking at the top of the water, but it was kind of scary actually. And we were literally just where those people are there. We were like five feet past them and it just like, we were swimming as hard as we could just to get back to shore, so yeah. be careful.